Hello guys, welcome to another Hacky Tip video. And this is a quick fix for the Electrovoice ZX-A1 powered speaker. And I guess it would work on the passive speaker also. They're about the same. This is 19 pounds and it has a problem. Some people have read the reviews online. Some people are complaining that it's not balanced, not in terms of sound, but in the way that they mounted the pole adapter here on the bottom as you can see it's not in the center it's all the way to the end i guess that was a way of reducing the size of, of the speaker and making it more compact and all that but it does create problems with people using small stands and in my case i i would like to raise the speaker a little bit higher than usual to maybe eight nine feet high and it could create a problem with smaller stands. As you can see, there's about four and a quarter inch difference between the center of gravity, which uh, I just put the speaker on this PVC adapter here and to find out where the center of gravity was. And it's about four and a quarter inches difference from where it, where it is presently. To get to that point, I came up with this solution. It involves a few parts. And this is the first one. It's a K&M, it's called the K&M speaker adapter. It does have these two bolts that you really don't need, but they're on the plate. And it's a K&M speaker wall mount adapter plate 24358. That's the part number. It's price is about $12.99 online. And the next part that you're going to need is this, it's called the Trust, the brand is Trust Totem Speaker Stand Adapter, and it has a 10 millimeter uh, mount on the bottom. I got the longest 10 millimeter that would fit in there, <clears throat> I believe it's about 30 millimeters, uh, and, a, and a washer. So that's another part, and the third one is... An on-stage sleeve, it's called the on-stage SSA2 speaker stand adapter sleeve. And basically I just put a washer inside, we'll go right in here, the washer. And this is just a quarter inch and adapter there to screw it down. So that's it, let me put it together and I'll continue uh, at the end and show you how this would mount on a speaker. First thing you need to do is, let's start with this side. You see this would go like this. These screws will, would go down, then you tighten it. On this side, a lot of turning, but I, I would rather have that, you know, the longer thread, just in case it com comes loose, it has more thread to prevent it from falling. And the next step, I guess you can align this a little differently if you want. You can just hand tighten it. There we go. The next step is putting this side, the sleeve. The sleeve would go, there's the washers already in there. And then I got this, this flat bolt on this side. And then the bolt on this side. There we go, it's kind of, it's pretty flat when you, when you put it on there. Let the washer sit at the bottom of the sleeve, you see here? And then you put the bolt. And in this case, I'm using one of these adapters for a microphone stand, which is a quarter inch, just to make it easier so I don't have to use any tools to put it in there. But you can use any nut that you prefer. There we go, we finally got it inside. And it's just a matter of turning it till we get it all the way down. And we can hand tighten it. That should be good enough. Now it's tight on both sides. And there we go. This is basically it. 
just a matter of mounting it on the speaker. This is gonna go like this here. Obviously. And the other thing you should do is to tighten it when you're putting it on the speaker. Make sure you tighten this set screw over here. There's a little screw here that you can tighten just to make sure it doesn't come out. Going in here, just a regular, regular screwdriver. Tighten it here well enough so that it doesn't pull out. It's pretty secure, as you can see. And it's just a matter of mounting it on the speaker pole. And we have a pretty balanced speaker now. Next, I'm gonna show you how it looks on the speaker pole. Okay, here's the speaker already mounted on a speaker stand. It has a 30 pound round base. It's a gravity speaker base. Take a quick look here and see what it looks underneath. It's a release here. And <laughs> It's going pretty high. So this is what it looks, from, how it looks from the bottom of the speaker. It's pretty solid. I mean, I don't think it's going anywhere. And that could be a pretty good solution for someone trying to mount these speakers higher. And let me show you how it looks from, this is all the way to about eight feet high. There is a speaker about eight feet high and it's pretty stable. There it is, another solution for the electro voice zx a1 speakers hope that you found this video useful check out our other videos there's some sound tests with these uh, electro voice speakers take a look at our videos and subscribe like thank you very much for watching bye